Hey guys, Carl Cunard here, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video is a ASOS haul. I've picked out some pieces that I feel fit spring, summer perfectly. Also, I have a very exciting trip planned. I am going to LA in the next couple of weeks to attend Coachella for the first ever time. I am so buzzing and some of these items will be coming with me. So we've got a couple of jackets, we've got some very standout t-shirts and finally, what would a haul be from myself without a couple of pair of cropped trousers? So you do not want to miss them at the end. Right, so the first jacket that I went for, I feel fits very festival vibes slash Coachella for me very well. It's this edgy denim sleeveless jacket. Now, I've been to LA many times before and I know it can get very hot, but also in the evening, the temperature can drop dramatically. So I wanted to go for this because it's not too thick, but it also has the sleeveless design as well. So I've kind of got a bit of air coming in on my arms. But it's very edgy, it's got these rough, kind of unfinished, sleeves so it's not very cleanly cut. Now moving on to the next two jackets. So these are actually the same denim jacket. I just got them in two different colours. I've never actually purchased one with a bit more colour to it and as we are moving into warmer temperatures I like to add a bit more colour to my wardrobe. So I went for this kind of tan denim jacket. Again the material is not too thick. This is probably something that throughout the day I'll be wearing over my shoulders or carrying around with me or probably knowing, like me, losing it around Coachella. But in the evening, it's just the perfect little addition to add on to your outfit. I feel that for t-shirt designs for me, I go for very white and black. So these colors that I've gone for in the jacket always will fit both of those colors. So I know that I kind of wouldn't wear an orange t-shirt or a yellow t-shirt with a kind of a tan orange jacket. Now I've got small in all of these so I think it's very true to size and um, it's not kind of too big on the sleeves or anything the back as well just another good jacket that's going to be coming with me perfect moving into the warmer temperatures because kind of your bigger coats and your long kind of coats all want to kind of be put hopefully to one side because the weather is going to be spicing up and then finally from the jackets we've gone for this kind of olive colour Another colour that I'm really into at the moment is kind of khaki, olive, slash green. Um, I just feel like, again, it fits really nice with a white tee, as you can see. I just think these are going to be really nice to add into my suitcase for Coachella, and I feel like these could be a really nice addition for you as well, adding into your wardrobe for spring, summer. So this is the first t-shirt. I keep trying to do my hair, but I just think it's going to be messed up by the end of this video with all the t-shirts that I have, so I've decided not to actually care. So this is the first t-shirt. I actually purchased this a couple of weeks ago on a previous um, ASOS order that I did that I didn't do a haul on. But the reason why I've brought it in today's video is because when I've wore it, it's got such great attention from people over on my Instagram. So if you don't already follow me on there, I'll pop it up there for you. Come over, drop me a follow. I'm always posting different outfit inspirations and different things I've purchased that don't always make it onto my YouTube. But it is from ASOS, so I wanted to include it today. Again, I just think this is something that's a little bit different to your typical normal plain white or plain black or even a small logo tee. I just think this really is something that pops. It's going to stand out. Personally, this is probably going to be going back. It is free returns, which is great because I don't always love everything that I order, but you can probably tend to see a trend that's going on here. I love pinstripes and stripes, but this one, I just feel like one, it's a little bit too plain. Uh, unlike the last one, it doesn't fit very well around the sleeves. I prefer a tighter fit on my arm. And also, it doesn't say long line on the actual tag or online, but I do feel like it's quite a long top. So this is in a small, but I just feel like it's a bit long. And if I kind of reel it up like that, it's going to look a bit baggy. And guess what? The next tee is also striped. Now, I actually love the stripes on this one. I love the colours, I love that it says Los Angeles. I really like how it's put together. However, unfortunately, again, the fit is just not right for me. This is a small, it's too flimsy on the arms. Um, it's too long again. Again, it didn't say long line. I feel like it's kind of an in-between. I prefer something that sits a little bit higher 
um, just kind of below the belt. This is probably something I'd wear more around the house if it was a bit more floaty. So I promise this is the last kind of stripe t-shirt that I have. I love this one. This is definitely going to be kind of staying in my wardrobe. I just think it's a little bit something different. I feel kind of like a bit of a baseball player in it. Um, but yeah, I just like the difference that it has to it. With the zip, I could probably wear this also. It's a very thin material, but very nice kind of feel as well. So I could probably wear this with a white t-shirt underneath and wear it when the temperature drops a little bit. So you've got your white t-shirt showing through the zip and this could kind of be more used as a very thin sweater. So the final t-shirt is this designed logo tee from ASOS own brand. Now Rolling Stones had a t-shirt like this, it's still probably floating around now, and it's just a tongue on the front. I don't know why, it just caught my eye on the website, it's nothing kind of crazily out there, but I just feel like red also pops really well on black and it just works. Okay, so the first prop trouser that I purchased is this pinstripe design. I already have this exactly the same design in so many different colours already in my wardrobe. You've probably, if you follow me already on Instagram, seen me so many times in a pair just like these, just in different colours because I love them so much and you guys always compliment me when I wear them. So I just wanted to add a new colour to my wardrobe. So I went for this light coloured beigey brown, perfectly for spring summer. Um, I'm going to move the camera down now, just so you can see the crop of the trouser. I like when it sits just above the ankle because I do normally roll them and wear them with a pair of sneakers. Bring the camera back up. So that is my first pair of cropped trousers. I'm gonna move on to my last purchase now, which is another pair of cropped trousers. And this is the final item that I purchased. These are from Boohoo on the ASOS website. I actually love these so much. The fit is just spot on. I always look for when I get a pair of cropped trousers around the bottom, how it sits. I like it to kind of show off my peachy bum and not look like a bag of saggy potatoes, which I think these show it off really well. You tell me. Um, the colour, a nice light grey again, ready for spring summer. Has a very nice texture um, to the design of the trouser as well. You've got these two simple lines down the side that just add something a little bit different. Also, you've got these strings on the front. I like this because you can wear this in the day for more of a casual event and just tie the strings. Or you have got the option to add a belt on as well, which I would do more in the evening just to kind of break up your outfit with the belt going through the middle. Taking the camera down again, you can see that the crop, just like the last one, is just above the ankle, which is what I love. And also, I like when a pair of trousers is not too tight around kind of your quad area and the bottom of your legs, um, bringing the camera back up, because it's just not comfortable when you're sitting down or walking when it's too tight around your legs, so these are perfect. But this is my last purchase. I'll be linking everything that I've shown you in today's video down in the description box below. If you wanna see what Coachella outfits I'm wearing, don't forget my Instagram is there again. Come over and drop me a follow. Also say hello so I know you've come over from YouTube so I can say a big hello to you back. And that is it for today's video. Don't forget to give me that all important thumbs up. And if you are a new person to my channel, thanks for joining me and hopefully stay with me all the way until the end. Don't forget, if you're not already, to go and click that subscribe button. And I'll be seeing you guys very soon on my next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.